on the YT to unbox with you this lovely diamond painting. If you are interested in where to find this diamond painting, you can go to www.diamondartclub.com. Search for the artist Mandy Manzano because that's who we're unboxing today. All right, a little bit about this painting. I'll show it to you sideways because that's the way uh, this diamond painting is in landscape. Uh, so, this is what it looks like here. Name of this painting is called Gator Swamp. It is a square drill painting and the size is 56 by 42 centimeters. And for your ease, I have already taken the plastic off the top so you don't have to sit there and watch me struggle. So we just gonna pop the top like that. <laughs> Okay, what's in here? Well, it's a diamond painting, so there's a canvas. Oh, oh it's in a clear sleeve this time. There's the canvas. Uh, what else? And there's my diamond. And then down in there, you can't see it, but down in there is the drill kit. And the drill kit comes with one diamond pin, two waxes, or maybe one in this one because it's not as big as the other ones. Maybe one. Um, some plastic small Ziploc bags to keep your extra diamonds and a wax plate for the drills. Not a, not a wax plate, what? A drill plate. So you can put your drills in and shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it and get those diamonds ready to get on that canvas. Speaking of canvas, let's go ahead and pop this thing open. Right, so I'm going to roll this backwards so that it will lay out flat. And while I'm rolling, I'm going to tell y'all a little bit about me and why I decided to get this painting. So, I am from Louisiana, but now I live in Texas. And this painting, I believe Mandy is from or lives in or I don't know. So she's affiliated with either Louisiana in some kind of way because she has a lot of paintings that are uh, in that same that same culture and that same, you know what I mean? You know? I, mean, I don't know. Sometimes I don't know what I mean. All right, so that's why I decided to get this one. It reminds me of home. Look how pretty, and all these greens. I love greens. All right, so let's look at it. It's not, it's not that big. It's, it's, a, it's a really decent size, and it's coming through. It looks, man, it looks amazing on camera um and i'm pretty sure it's gonna look amazing when i finish it but yeah it reminds me of home driving on the interstate going to new orleans and on to those places you you pass pl <laughs> places on the side of the road that look exactly like this and i just think that mandy did an amazing job capturing it uh, look they even have the little um the moss hanging from the trees. Oh, I mean, that's that's amazing. Yeah, um, the dirty swamp water right there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so yeah, this 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 reminds me of home, and now I get to have a little piece of home here in Texas with me via this diamond painting. All right, let's get into some facts about this diamond painting. It is thirty colors. There are two schematics: one at the top left, one at the bottom right. So if you're ever working on it in a different direction and you're closer to one side, you can hurry up and look at that and uh, get your information from there. But I don't even use the schematics anymore because the way that I kit up my uh, diamond paintings, I just put the symbols on little stickers and then I just do it like that. Like I'll look at the painting, see what I need, pop the top on the box of the drills for that symbol. So I don't really use the schematics anymore um but let's 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 look at them i'll go through them uh with you pretty slow i'll pan it um the symbols are you know pretty much uh the same they use the same ones diamond art club does for all their diamond paintings and then this picture is going to have a lot of greens all right and that is 30 colors Oh, wow, look. Oh, no, no. I, I thought I was like, oh, they changed the 310 symbol. But nope, they didn't. Good old Diamond Art Club. Always keeping it, keeping it, you know, as 
Less change as possible. All right. Keeping it the same across the board. I like that. I like that a lot. Let's get into these drills. I'm sorry about the noise. It'll be over. Boom. Just that fast. It's over. And I already see a color. My favorite one. I think this is my favorite one right here. All right. Let's get into the big bag. Oh, it is. It is my favorite one. Yeah, 3819 is my fave color, my fave drug color. All right. 783, 890, 782, 898. There are two bags of the 898. 73. There are two bags of the 3371. And there are one, two, three, four bags of the 310s. One bag of the 434. And last of the big bags is 938. All right, and then we have a small small size bag. These are the small size. 166. 166 is pretty too. And those are the greens. 9 on 1. 4, 4, 4. 38, 64. 38, 11. That's a pretty color. 8, Two, three, eight, zero, three, seven, one, two, six, six, I'm sorry, six, seven, seven, nine, oh, seven. I feel like I'm calling out bingo numbers. <laughs> Waiting for someone to yell bingo. <laughs> I, four, four, five, come on down. <laughs> Three eight one four nine nine three nine nine two. Oh, those are really pretty. Oh, those are like those minty. Would you say that's mint or like turquoise or like what color would you say this is? Mm, I think it's like a mint, mint chocolate chip. <laughs> nine oh five. So looks like a true green. Oh, this one is beautiful right here. Nine five four. Yes. Yes, it's really pretty. 939-906-726, bright yellow. And last one in the bunch, 904. All right, sorry about that. If you are interested in getting this diamond painting, like I said, you can get it at diamondartclub.com under the artist Mandy Manzano and can't wait to get this one started I think it's gonna be absolutely gorgeous and I don't think it will take me that long it is a square squares do take me a little bit longer than the round ones um, but I like squares uh, a lot squares is actually what I started off with. So now uh, a lot of people say to start with rounds and then go into squares. Um, I didn't do it like that. <laughs> I started with squares, so squares is kind of just like what I'm used to. And when I did my first round, I was like, oh my God, this is, I was so much faster. Um, so a little interesting fact about me. All right, so, um, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you later. Bye.